Hello there everyone, it's Shiny Sparky14 and welcome back to more Final Fantasy 1 Anniversary Edition. Last time we took care of Death Gaze and something I didn't do is actually exit the Whisperwind Cove once I beat him, you know, I just stayed there. But I decided to just leave off screen, but yeah, all you have to do is just leave that place. I did not, ca I did not get that on camera, so, on camera, on screen, whatever. Anyways, as you can see, I did a number of stuff off screen. First off, the level ups up to level 65. Because it is strongly recommended that you are this level before you take on the Life Spring Grotto. The Life Spring Grotto is no doubt the hardest of these four Soul of Chaos dungeons. So you do want to be at least, I mean at least level 60 some people can do it at that level, but I'm going higher, 65. By the time you fight the other boss, level 70 is preferred, but it's going to be difficult, let's just say that. Now another thing, uh, best cherry. So first off. We have Death Gaze, who I actually did not go over. But here's Death Gaze, 30,000 HP. Here's the stats, pretty good stats I must say, especially that magic defense, very, very good. Good thing we used all pure physical attacks. Weakness, fire, and Dia, so it wasn't undead. But because of his high magic defense, yeah, it's better to use physical. Anyways, there's a couple enemies. First off, there's a yellow dragon here, which we fought off screen. I mean, I didn't, yeah, I didn't capture this on screen. I'll explain why later. This one. And then down here, a blood tiger. There we go. Not not a very great monster, but there you go. I believe that's it. Yeah. So we got those two enemies on screen. Now, the reason why is because I actually went to the Whisperwind Cove again. I made it all the way until 20, floor 20. And I got another rune stab. It's going to be important to get another rune stab. It's recommended to get two, but I'm going with just one into the Life Spring Grotto. So yeah, you do want to do that. Other stuff that we got are actually these. Um, MP, go ahead and give it to you. Silver Apple, I'm gonna go ahead and give it to the one with the less HP, which is you. And Power Plus, raises strength. I'll just give that to John. And then Stamina Plus, give it to John. I'm just gonna give all these to John, why not? There we go. Alright. So we took care of that. Now that we've done all that, let's go ahead and go to the Life Spring Grotto. So, the way that you go there is by, only by ship. So you actually have to go back to your ship, yes, believe it or not, you still use the ship for one- Oh, damn it! Are you kidding me? A shark. A random shark, which I'm gonna show on screen just for the hell of it. But there we go, shark down. Alright. So anyways, we wanna go here. And this is the Life Spring Grotto, at least the entrance. I don't know if I ever went here once just to show this place, but... Um, there would be a statue right here, as you already know, and yeah, you know. He would be blocking you until you beat the Kraken, which is the third boss, the third of the four fiends. Anyways, Life Spring Grotto Floor 1. So in here there's going to be a lot of underwater areas, I guess, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, so this first one is, as always, I'm trying to find it because it is, um, again, there's, there's a lot of water places, there really is. So it's kind of important to know where the hell you're going, you know, what you're doing. But, I do believe it's actually, actually no, I don't really know where it is, where the hell I am. Let's see, down here, dude, an encounter. And starting with some pythons, I'll just go ahead and keep this one on screen. But, you know, like I said, I'm just going to be cutting a lot of battles. Once we start encountering a lot of the same ones, you know, then it kind of makes sense to, you know, just take them out. Because we don't need to be showing that repetitive thing, you know? But anyways, so l let's see, where the hell am I again? Okay, I'm right... I'm trying to find this little... And again, I don't see the point of cutting it if I'm just going to be saving... Yeah, here's the stairs. If I'm just going to be saving in a very, very small amount of... Of, uh, of time. It doesn't really make sense to do that. But anyways, in this floor, we have to go to... Alright, the stairs are, are down there, alright. So I guess the easiest way to go down here would be... Huh, which way would be easier? Down here. Oh, wait, oh, I can't go through here, are you kidding me? God damn it. That means I have to go up and around. Which kind of sucks. No, I'm not even going to waste my time fighting that. I, I believe it takes longer to kill it and... You know. Let me go. Are you kidding me? Can you not run from these guys? That's kind of interesting actually. Now, how are you going before everybody? You're, you're not fast. You're a tornado. Well, actually, tornadoes are fast, yeah. So, never mind. 
Anyways, we gotta go down here, and the encounter rate is too ridiculous. What the hell are these? Are these new enemies? I don't know. You know, I should have just... Wait, Sahaj and Queen. Did we already fight Sahaj and Queen? I know we fought Sahaj and Chief. We fought Sahaj and... Huh. Actually, I don't really remember. Yeah, I really can't say. 1698 damage. Wow. Like for your standard, that, that's crazy. That really is. Alright, let's go ahead and take a look. Blue Curtain. Let's take a look at the best Chieri to see if we did take care of a Sahaja and Queen before. No, we hadn't, huh? Nope. Sahaja and Queen, 100 HP. Okay, pretty bad enemy, but there we go. Sahaja and Queen. Okay, so now we have to go down. Now this room probably has... No, never mind, it does not. It does not. Freaking encounters, man. Seriously. No, I'm not going to waste my time on you. Even though you're just one enemy, like seriously. Alright, so we gotta go down and then through this room right here. Okay, there's a chest, let's take it. 400 gil garbage. Um, now we have to go to the right. Here, just go straight to the right and we get taken to these stairs. Light Spring Grotto B3. So, basement floor 3 is an ice, so the ice one is actually, where's my ice one? Right up here. Alright, the stairs for this one are actually in the... What the hell? Um, technical difficulties? No, not really. But, okay. So we have to go. I mean, I'm trying to find the stairs, but they're usually, if they're like hidden away, that kind of sucks because then, then I can't really see them easily. Okay, I see them now. I see them. All we have to do is go to the right, up, up here, and then more to the right. And never, never mind, a bit higher. Up here. Go through these spikes, take a little bit of damage, and here are the stairs. B4. Alright. B4 is a sky fortress like area. Um, so this one's going to be. Let me see. Where the sky fortress map? Okay, here's the sky fortress map. This one. For this one, the stairs, or not the stairs in here, it's actually a teleporter. But you want to go down here. All the way down until you reach a. I don't know if it's a fork. Not really. Um, Over here, to the right go down or whatever here and an encounter of course death elemental okay I can't really escape from these guys so I'm just gonna try and attack you and kill you I don't want to be wasting turns you know attacking and stuff attacking running I meant there we go and here is this warp all right light spring grotto b5 so this one is Let's see, how do you handle this? Okay, I think I remember this. Let's see. Um, okay. So, a strange man, huh? Alright. What we have to do is actually come up here, and there's going to be some mermaid right here. I believe I have to talk, you have to talk to this one. A whole new batch of stuff to wash up today. You never know. Never mind, it's not you. I thought it was you. I guess, I guess not. Um, okay, nobody here. So I guess we gotta go... Okay, what do you have to say? Are you people? That's funny. <laughs> oh my god. Um, alright. Uh, did you unlock the door? Yes, you did. Does that mean you're here? I believe you are. Let's see. Yeah, I do believe Gilgamesh is actually... Oh, oh I just spoiled the name. Man, it's not really spoiling, I mean... Most of you kind of already knew that, but I mean, we're going to be taking care of this in the next video. This might be a shorter one, actually, a little bit over 11 minutes, but it's alright. I don't want to be, you know, showing the introduction of this place and the first boss in this one. So, thank you for watching. Goodbye, everybody, and until next time.